everyone. Clyde, stop staring at me and say hello. Oh, my darling, I was just gazing into your sparkling eyes. Well, stop it and say hello to all those people out there. Oh, hello, all you beautiful people. My name is Clyde and I am a French Camille. This is my very beautiful Camille. Well, I must say it's nice to see all of you out there. Ah, yes it is, my dear. Well, we've been having such an amazing time on our holiday this year. Or oh, any time with you, my dear, is uh, special. Well, Clyde, you have been doing many heroic things this holiday. Ah, yes, I am an hero. But don't you think an hero such as myself deserves a kiss from you, my dear? Oh, don't start, Clyde. It's not even tea time. Oh, she is breaking my heart. But I still love her. Why don't you tell everyone what you've been up to, Clyde? OK, I will. At the beginning of our holiday, we went camping. Oh, it was wonderful. The outside air, the nature, it was so romantic. Well, not for me. I mean, I couldn't believe he took me camping. A camel of my class wouldn't normally go camping. But he did look after me. His moment of heroism came when I sent him for firewood. You see, I can't have my beautifully manicured hooves getting cold. Uh, you see, I was getting firewood and I came past these children who had already lit their fire and it was getting out of control. They could have been burned. That's exactly what I thought. So I braved the flames and I spat on the fire. I can't believe you spat on it, Clyde. But a camel is just came natural to me. I cannot help it. Luckily it worked and the fire was soon put out. And the children were safe. So that was Clyde's first heroic act of the holiday. Oh, come on, Camille. Surely that deserves a kiss. Behave, Clyde. And besides, you couldn't do heroic things just to get a kiss from me. Oh, no, you have me all wrong. The kiss is just a bonus, my dear. The second thing that happened on this holiday was when we went to Wales. I was just walking around when I saw an old lady carrying some very heavy shopping. Well, she looked lost and struggling, so I offered to carry her on my back. She was very grateful, and she was able to rest her shopping on me ump. That was a really nice thing to do, Clyde. And then surely, my dear, that deserves a kiss from you. Uh, no. Oh, it was worth a try. There was one other thing I did when, on, on this holiday, wasn't there, my dear? Yes, I nearly forgot. You did something for me, Clyde. Oui, oui, indeed, my dear. You see, I have a fear of snakes. And when we were camping, we saw one. Oh, and I just don't like them at all. I don't like the thought of them climbing up my legs and hissing in my ears. A big python had slithered its way into our area and it was just about to climb up your leg when I saw it and jumped in front of you and chased it away. Yes, you were very brave, Clyde. Ah, uh, thank you, my dear. Does that mean I am your hero? Well, yes, I guess you are my hero. Does this mean that I can have a kiss from my beautiful darling Camille? Well, I suppose so, but just one. And don't get too excited. Oh, Camille, that was wonderful. Well, you have been very brave. That is because I knew that I could trust God to be with me and help me do these things to help others. That's true, Clyde. We can all trust God to help us, to have courage to do the right thing. Well, my dear, we had better go. Au revoir. Bye, everyone.